So what I've done is the way I've, I've modeled my current team is I have modeled it in the same format we've been discussing today. Yeah, mm -hmm. this, this is something that I did uh, two years back. So when you're building a team, I, may, may, I, I was conscious enough to, to keep certain core, core processes internal and also, also certain processes that are non-core to external people and people mm -hmm. who can do that job. So which means that you don't need to necessarily have a large team anymore. You can mm -hmm. manage with a very with a very small workforce, and HR does not need to be there present everywhere. Every mm -hmm. people manager is responsible for his own people. It's not HR responsibility, and that's an important point that I want to mention. So, therefore, do we really need so many HR people? It's a it's a point to think about. And so, mm -hmm. therefore, when I was building my team, Sudeep, I must tell you that you know I was very conscious that whoever I add in will be hands on. Okay, we'll, un we'll need to understand the business as Ranga mentioned. If you do not have an understanding of the business very well, you will never be successful in getting the right people in and actually making your company profitable and productive, uh, productive, uh, productive in, the, in, the, in the near future. If you do not mm -hmm. understand, uh, you know, uh, I'm giving a manufacturing setup. If you do not understand what the person at the line is doing, you will not understand the level of engagement that the person is on. Yeah, if you do sure. not understand the person in a retail store who's talking to a customer, his pain point, you will face issues of you know attrition and so on and so forth. So I think an HR person should not be sitting at his desk and he has to be out there in the field to understand people far more better. Yeah, sure. that is that is a fundamental, and I, I'm putting it in very simple English. They need to be out there to understand business, to understand jobs better and i want to make another proposition uh, uh, today also in in addition to what i proposed earlier you know hr could even be given a six months stint in, in a business function to really understand the business function yeah that will enable them to understand it far better than you know being a silent observer when you actually put your hands to do it yes that is when the difference will take place 